What's going on guys? God bless you. Carlos here with Serrano's Mobile Detail in Dallas, Texas. Thank you so much for joining me in today's video. Today we are talking about the Ninja Scrub versus the new to me, I've never heard of this one, the Sumo Scrub. Uh, as you guys have seen in previous videos, I have been strictly using the Sumo Scrub just to kind of get a feel for it see what I think about it and I'm very excited uh, to do a comparison video right um, so anyways stick around let me get set up and we'll get started let's start with the ninja scrub the ninja scrub comes in at about 14 99 i believe i could be wrong on the price uh, so don't dig me on that one but i've seen it for about 14 dollars right uh the ninja scrub has two sides one side is very um i call it, this is more like of the aggressive side it's some very very thin nylon fibers i believe i could be wrong and then you flip it to the other side you have a microfiber side right um when i first got this one I was wowed um, because I've never really used scrub pads um, and I was very excited and really I was using this for everything when it came to the doors you know everything it cleaned really really well because of the fibers that are in this sponge right um, <clears throat> and I've had this one I think for almost a year and a half I think since I started using this one's getting old uh, but it's definitely done its job uh, for $14.99, really, I could not complain on the price uh, and how well uh, it performed, right? Usually, when I use the Ninja Scrub, I usually we're, we're going to use the PNS Interior Cleaner. Usually, I would do like two sprays on here. And then I would go ahead and agitate. And that would remove any major grime, any major um, dirt that could have been on there, right? When working on newer cars like this, or cars or vehicles that are not in bad shape, such as this Tundra, uh, you really don't want to do a lot of, like spraying the door panel and all that, but you were able, you're able to clean it fairly, fairly well, right? And then it has this, microfiber side where you're able to maybe flip it around uh, and if you want to put like your dressing then you could definitely do that as well as you can condition your door panel right um, so that is one of the benefits this scrub pad has um, so i've really enjoyed it in many scenarios uh, usually on more of maintenance customers or vehicles such as this 2022 tundra that i've been working on for the past three days um this thing came in tore tore up um but we finally finished it customer added the interior detail and that's what we're doing as well is getting all the interior blown out blown out scrubbed and everything right so these scrub pads come really in handy for these types of scenarios all right <clears throat> the sumo scrub um this one is very very new to me i didn't i've never seen uh, a scrub pad like this um this one here you can purchase it locally um at drive auto appearance these are about nine dollars um I'm waiting for them to put it on their website. Uh, he just revamped the website, so it's been a little bit tough. Uh, I've had a lot of people inbox me and say like, hey, I don't see that one on the website. Um, so they're working on that. It'll soon be up there. So I do apologize uh, about this pad here, but I'm sure maybe you can find it in other um, websites or in other detailing websites. The Sumo Scrub. My honest thoughts on this, when I grabbed it, um, I felt very like i don't know <clears throat> i took it out the package and i remember the first thing i was doing is i was literally looking at it like man this thing looks like it's gonna damage some cars um but cameron was like have you ever tried a sumo scrub and i was like no so he gave it to me uh and when when i opened it i was like dang this feels rough um <clears throat> but you know 
cam was like, trust me, this thing is legit. It was not going to scratch. So I was like, all right, you know, I'll definitely take it, play with it and see what I think about it. And I got to say, I'm very, very impressed on how well this thing performs. Uh, so it has two sides. Uh, one side is more of the, it's like the rougher side. And then this side here is more of the softer side, right? Which comes into play in many scenarios, right? If I'm working on this door panel that's not dirty, um, both sides are really amazing. Um, I would probably tend to use this side here, the more um, coarse side. But even though it feels rough, it is very safe on interior. So we're going to do the same thing. Spray the cleaner. And, you know, safely agitate. And it does really, really well. I know probably for this video comparison or, or seeing it work in action might not work. So I do apologize. Um, but you can feel safe that you can use this on your plastics, on your doors. You can also use it um, <clears throat> on your leather seats. On leather seats, it's really when I see this thing work because you are actually agitating uh, and you can feel you can feel this thing work i feel like with this one i may need to do maybe like one two three four five six strokes with this one i can literally do like one two and you're done right or one two and you're done it's less less work with this one as to with this one you have to really do more scrubbing with the sumo scrub it's really what i call a one and done and you're good uh cleans your leather nicely leaves it nicely you won't see no scratches you won't see nothing like that um and then you can switch it over to this white side here this white side is a little bit different on the on the uh material obviously i don't know what the material is some people said like bamboo nylon i don't know um but i you know some people probably have more information on this than I will. Um, <clears throat> but it is really, really solid. Honestly, for the price, $9, way less than the Ninja Scrub. This one has just an amazing cutting power. Um, another thing I do like about this pad is that when you're working on upholstery, uh, if you're doing like little spots, you know, spot cleanings or anything like you can literally use this pad on your upholstery to scrub agitate and it does really really well i recently tested this theory on a toyota corolla that i did a couple days ago um, and i literally use it on the upholstery on the cloth seats and agitate it and you could tell really how quickly this thing was agitating right um so it did really really well as far as the maintenance on these sponges all you have to do most likely is just get some um some warm water spray some maybe like dawn dish soap or preferred cleaner you know agitate it on both sides and then wring it out and then it has this nice little um hanging thing that you can probably hang it on your um on your truck or wherever you dry your stuff and the next day it'll be ready to go uh, but overall really this product uh has done really really well And before I end this video, guys, I want to show you guys just quick close up uh, on both pads. One of the Ninja Scrub and then one of your uh, Super Bros Sumo Scrub. And you can definitely see the, the materials, um, how just different they are, right? The Sumo Scrub just has more of that cutting edge technology, uh, just cleans better. The Ninja Scrub just has the more finer um, nylon bristles. I think that's what they are. I don't know again. Um, but you can kind of see and compare uh, as far as going in depth into the fibers of these sponges. And you get to see really um, how well uh, just they both look, right? In my preference, I'm definitely going to be switching over to the Sumo Scrub just because I have seen just much more cutting, much more cleaning power, less work. Um, as far as agitation, right? Um, but hashtag Serrano's Mobile, hashtag Sumo Scrub, and hashtag Drive Auto Appearance. 
if you made it all the way to the very end, uh, I have four. I purchased four of these sumo scrubs that I want to give to you guys. Four lucky winners one week from today um, will be um, entered um, to get one of these sponges. Again, hashtag Serrano's Mobile, hashtag Sumo Scrub, and hashtag Drive Auto Appearance. If you've been here for those giveaways, you already know what to do. If you're new to the channel and you may be wondering what the heck is he doing? If you're new to the channel, whenever I say any hashtags or if you see hashtags anywhere in this video, that probably means <coughs> there's a giveaway. Uh, and all you have to do is enter the hashtags to be entered. Enter them correctly because if you don't, the system will not read them and your name probably won't be entered into the system. So make sure you input them correctly. If not, the system is not going to pick it up. So as always, guys, I hope this video kind of helped you guys kind of compare the Ninja Scrub versus the Sumo Scrub, right? As always, God bless you guys, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.